Hello everyone, welcome back and this is Naveen from UA Brains. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about uh, uh, one new application of JavaScript using uh, DOM manipulation that is SMS app. So I have, uh, sh I, I'll just show you here. So this is how the application looks like. Uh, SMS app and you have a text area here and you have to type something uh, what message you wanted. Okay. And here the number of characters 0 slash 100. Okay. So when I type one character is going to be one. So how many number of characters you're going to type. So let's keep increasing the count and it stops exactly at the 100. Okay. So this is a simple SMS app. Okay. So in this video, let's uh, start uh, this application okay see here so i have open uh live server now uh but we need a folder structure like a bootstrap so i'll do one thing uh file number 18 writes okay let's let's copy this outside folder i'll just paste it here i'll make it as a 19 underscore js underscore sms app Okay, so here in uh, HTML, I modified this as a SMS app and uh, here also SMS app and let's add some margin bottom 3 and uh, here let's start with SMS, SMS app. Okay. Uh, so yeah so set up ready and let me open this in the live server so let me refresh open the sms app yeah so let me design the uh, app first and then we'll start with the dom manipulation so we need a card again so card with the header body and footer so let's start here i write one container one row and call md6 uh, one card card header and then uh, card uh, body and then card uh, footer okay let's check yeah i got a card and the card i'll add bg primary and text uh, white and let's make uh, h3 sms app and below this i need to have a text area so let's add a form first uh, form you write a division with the class called form group I write uh, text area so text area with the number of rows uh, I add uh, some four rows and the class called form control and let's make a placeholder let's say your text uh, here okay uh, fine uh, I want to make some nice background color I just add bg light to get some nice background color fine looks good and below in the card footer i want something um i just write some h3 the characters remaining and uh, here i wanted uh, the the number so let me write a span tag let's take zero so slash 100 okay it is like this and this zero i want to make some color i'll give the class called font which bold and text um text uh, primary just want to highlight uh, the the number okay fine so this is a very basic setup and you want you can change the background color of the footer as well let's add some bg bg light but text to white text to white but this is not looks good okay then don't leave it not required fine this is looks good fine uh, so now uh, okay so design ready now whatever i am typing here based on that i want to make a count of here so again uh, it's you are typing each and every character so this is an event called uh, key up event and for every key up event happens gets the value and gets its length and update its length over here so what i do is i need the um, 
uh, text area involves in DOM manipulation and this also involves in DOM manipulation. So let's make two IDs for them. One is for text area. So uh, text area, I'll write an ID text minus area and for the span because I want to update this number. So for that, I need an ID. ID just say count, not count. Let's take character count. Okay. It is text area and car account. So let's start with actually DOM manipulation. Uh, so back to app.js here. Again, uh, SMS app. So let's text area el text area element is equal to document dot query selector of hash uh, text minus area okay and let uh, character count element is equal to document dot query uh, selector of uh, hash uh, car minus count so please check it is hyphen or underscore yeah it's hyphen and here also it's hyphen okay fine and then you have to apply an event call key up on a text area so let's say text area elements dot add event listener of a key up events comma one function so here i just need to get the value and its length attach over here so see if i enter one character it's gonna be the one if i say two it's gonna be the two so the number of characters length i wanted so how to get the length is generally how to get the value dot value so dot length so let's text entered okay just say text length is equal to my text area element dot value dot length yes i got a length so this length i want to attach to my this one so this is actually car count el so let's say car count el dot inner text is equal to uh, text length okay so that's it now check so when i type a you get one so whatever i'm typing this is something something if i'm keep typing it's increasing fine but it's, it's going more than 100 okay you know stop it you can restrict this from html uh, how can you do is uh, for your text area you can add max length 100 so it means it restrict for the maximum number of characters to be 100 so this is the restriction or the pattern i mean the validation okay so now check uh, so something something you keep typing so it's go up to 100 and it's not allowing you to add more than 100 characters so any number you can just take it off uh, 200 300 whatever okay so this how and make sure you write a max length of the same okay so whatever you written here same as the max length in your text area to restrict the number of characters allowed okay so that's it okay so this is what i want to show in this video and uh, very simple key up events okay so that's it enough for this video and uh, thank you so much for watching and we'll meet in the next video thank you mm -hmm.